All right. Yeah, maybe up there is where I want to be. Maybe that shitty mold infested section. Maybe that's... Yeah, maybe I should check that out. And now I'm really glad I waited for the mold part. Because I just wouldn't have been able to do any of this. Or for the mold resistance. Would have been really annoying. Having found this and then being told to go fuck off. Oh, hello. Did I just never notice? That seems pretty obvious. I guess I ran this way a lot, but still. Yeah, I just never- I think I just never noticed. Interesting. So, I guess it's telling me to go this way, then. Just gonna lick the walls a little every time. Gotta get that nutrition, after all. Oh, hello, everybody. They're all a little upset. Because, you know, that's their nature. I hope I'm not... I hope that every person we kill is not actually just an NSC guard. Or a ranger or whatever, that they're like being replicated or duplicated in some way. Because otherwise we've killed hundreds of people. Oh. We can't. That's a shame. Yeah, I mean they are already dead kind of until we find the cure, I suppose. Well, cool and pumps. There's a door we can't go into because it's just fucking locked. Might be quest related, who knows. All right, let's check out the pipe works. Shouldn't be anything in here. Nah, nah, I'm actually, I'm good. Unless, hmm. Unless we're supposed to chase that thing down, but I don't think so. No, it's kind of empty here. Yeah, we're good. Alright, let's go to the pump station. Just trying to look up as much as I can. Okay, anything in here? Doesn't look like it. Right, I've been in there, nothing was there. Nothing around here. Honestly, I don't think there was much down here either. It's a pretty small section. I think we were just fighting goo. I think this is for an Adi side quest. Alright, so I think we're done with the southern section as well. I suppose we'll, it's time to go see the furnace. And see what secrets lay beyond it. Which, yeah, this way. Hope I'm not missing too much. Uh, down here looks like death. Even, even with the ability to float. Nah, it looks like death. Yeah, how did I not notice that before? 
I guess it just... I guess I wasn't very used to mold or something, I don't know. Anything up here for me? Huh? Oh, oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. Nothing here. No weird boxes shifted into the ceiling. All right, let's do a, a checkpoint here. Back to the fern. Oh, wait, no. There is stuff up here, kind of. Oh, all right. I've fucked around with these pipes before, but I was like, ah, I can't possibly do anything else. So this is a secret that I should have found with float, not with what I have. What the fuck is with those TVs? I'm beginning to notice them more and more. Where did that even go? That, that's, it doesn't go anywhere. What the hell? It should be like right there. I don't think there's actually a room I can check out to like see where that fell. Yeah, those TVs are teleporting all over the fucking place, aren't they? Anyway, uh, I was trying to check out the remainder of this room. I think I'd been over here and there just kind of wasn't anything. Yeah. I don't think there's even anything up here, even if I go all the way. No, it's just a endless white void up there. And nothing to nothing to note over here that I can see. Alright. We fucked around long enough. Furnace. Whoops, whoops. I'm gonna say this room's clear. I don't see anything offhand on the ceiling. And we gave a good look around at the bottom. But we just couldn't climb up on this, but now we can. And it's locked. Well. Can I just. Can I just break it? No. No. There's, uh, there's grates in the way. It was a good, good guess, though. I don't see any other way in. Interesting. Am I supposed to get here from Black Rock Quarry? That's what it looks like. And I can't just smash the door down, because God forbid I use my powers to get places. <laughs> That'd break the game too much. Alright. Uh, and we did field training. We did central maintenance. We're just going to teleport to Black Rock. Quarry entrance, rather. Ah, yes, these fuckers. There's also a fair amount of things in here that I know... Oh, God. Uh, I know we can get to weird places with float.
like, you know, this. Oh, I'm gonna... Well, I wanted to make that not blind me. I'm going to actually grab, um, charge for this instead of grip. Because we have shit we want to explode. Not those in particular. But, um, there's like that's that there's a wall made up of objects that we had to break through before, and I think this gun will do pretty well for that. Okay, so we were definitely in here before, and we said, well, we can't get up this, but now we can. And I should switch to a gun that won't kill me if I shoot in close quarters. Yep, this place was made for floating. Don't know if I can actually go up there. I don't see anything. The lighting was freaking out, that's for fucking sure. Wow, what a shortcut we're about to make. Oh boy, Ritual Impulse. We needed that so badly. Probably. Hey! Okay, that's worth it. Perfect. There we go. Alright, back we go. If for some reason we needed to walk through there instead of teleporting? Hmm. Not really a point to that, is there? Oh well. Alright, so we're back in here. Okay, that's good. If there's no one around... Whoops. Or if there's no objects around, charge is pretty good. Still can't kill those fucking weird blobs. Still can't do it. Okay, we could get up here. We couldn't manage to get over here, though. Yeah, here we go. A lot of secrets in this later section. 31%. Do we care about that? Not really. But we'll grab it anyway. Lots of goodies. Some of which don't matter. <laughs> Darling, dimensional staffing. Dimensional research is going to change everything. The work we do there will be brilliant, dangerous, and revolutionary. So we'll need to staff that meet the challenge. So far I'm considering. Carla Vaughn, Lorenzo Dune, Hubert Tan, Edna Pierce. Either Beth Harrington or Abe Lewis, if the departments can spare them for a bit. Emily's an obvious choice, but who knows what will come out of the doorways we open. Perhaps it's better to keep her somewhere where the work is less unpredictable. But she won't like that. And there's no way we she won't notice a secret in your research department. She's too sharp. So Darling thought pretty high of Emily, turns out. It's the devil's music. Okay, so he was opening dimensions, which is probably where the hiss came from, huh? I think we already pretty much knew that. Alright, that is effective. I mean, if I have a clean shot, that's quite effective. Like, I don't have to aim too well. Kind of have to do it. Are they chucking grenades at me while I'm in the air? That doesn't seem that smart. Okay, so we made that loop. Ah, uh, 
Let's see. Whoop. Oh, hello. Uh, I'm gonna just, just do that. Also, as much as I do want to keep using charge. Oh, wait, no. I fucking forgot why I turned it on in the first place. We need to go downstairs and into the mold. I was avoiding this level because, you know, those things. This is even effective. I mean, I guess Black Rock is supposed to be like hard and difficult to break through, so. Alright, last time we died horribly the moment we went down here. Because we got shot by somebody. I don't know if it was a mold guy or something else, but we didn't really have much of a choice. Considering we couldn't float and we couldn't go down further. Yeah, we died right here. Anybody around? Oh, there you are. I see you. So, oh, God. Yeah, they're just sniping. Jesus. Let me get that health back. Right, anybody else? No? Great. Now, we already got the ability point for finding this area to begin with, so I guess the only thing we came down here for was that. Which is okay. It's fine. Is there a second hidden wall somewhere? No, it doesn't look like it. It'd be hard to tell anyway because of just all the smoke. Or all the spores? All the delicious air. Healthy, too. So that's done done and dealt with. I think the biggest question mark now is the quarry itself, which now that we can float, should be a lot more interesting. And nothing up there. I think we were actually above before when we were going to go to the uh, other side of the furnace. I think that might be the same shaft. Alright, so we could just go directly to it. But, because I want to make sure we don't miss anything, we're going to go past these guys. A lot less threatening when you can fly. <laughs> he's just in an office chair. Oh, he's fading away. Oh, right. They started out here, didn't they? Wait, did I already have flight when I came here? I forget. I don't remember now. Oh, Jesus. It's right here. Oh, God. Ow. I don't know how they got up there like that. I swear I floated up there. Oh, right. Give me your health, please. Anything. Oh, I landed next to an explosive! Whoops. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, let's start that again. Fortunately, we can just skip right on through. I'm still not sure how those guys got up there, though. That's the weird part. Do they spawn up there? Like, okay, let's see. I had initial, initially climbed just like right up here. 
And they seem to... S they really do seem to have spawned right here with me. When I was just trying to take a peek. I can't go through there. Yeah, that was weird, huh? Oh, yeah, I climbed it. How high up does this go? Oh, wait, piece of candy. Like, oh, uh, let's see. 44% uh, damage is actually pretty good. Don't care about zoom at all. Not even a little. Accuracy? Mm. I would say it doesn't really matter that much. I wonder if we can find some notes or something up here. There does seem to be just a lot of ground to cover. Lots of things set up, you know? Oh! And we have a voice over here. Or a voice, a uh... Maybe a plot indicator? I'm not really sure why it's drawing us here. Or is that just a control point? It could just be a control point. Oh, but I can't go in. Weird. God, these fucking lights. These lights are way too bright. Alright, well that's odd. Oh, I can't do that. Doesn't like that. Why would it... It want me to come in here? And yet, there must be a door or something in the center that I can't see. Maybe there's a drop in from the roof? Oh, is that my limit? Oh, no, never mind. Oh, fuck it. We'll, uh, we'll figure this out. Is this my limit? Nope, I just keep stopping for some reason. Well, this place actually fucking goes, doesn't it? Holy shit. Oh, wait, wait. That's my limit. Okay. We found the roof. Doesn't want us to go any higher than that. There mu then there must be another door somewhere in here. Or something. I don't know. That's weird, though. Oh, they're mad down there. Wonder if there's much else in here. I mean, it's a large enough section. Oh, like right here. But as far as actual secrets that you get ability points for, not really sure. Well, that's our. I wonder what's restricted beyond this. Hmm. There might be another one of those uh, item boxes in here somewhere. But we have found a couple before. And now we just found another two. Whoop. Yeah, they do teleport. They do teleport. Hmm. That's mysterious. But nothing we can do about it right now. 
So I think we're good. Oh, that's an elevator. And there is a mis question marks above it, so yeah, we'll come back here later, it seems. Oh, I guess I don't actually need that circle to aim. I can just kind of fling myself into the distance. Alright, let's get that health. 30%'s not bad. Alright. Research. I actually want to go... Where the fuck was it? Central research? Yeah, I want to I wanna go to do that fucking anchor. I've been thinking about that anchor. I want to know what that, that's about. Don't know if we're going to get a new ability when we kill it, or something else. But we may as well fuck with it now. Oh, we know that's the maze. Whoops, this isn't. This isn't what I wanted. Uh, what I was thinking of was in containment. Wow, there's so much to do. There's so many areas to look at. Uh Hmm. Where do we want to start? I think I'm going to skip ahead so that we can fight the anchor. Where was that anchor at? We did the Panopticon. That's all set. So don't we start from logistics? We also have to go to the medical wing for a side quest anyway. Let me just open a seltzer. I proceeded to spill everywhere. For some weird reason. That was odd. Good job, me. I did not have proper control over my drink. But it's also just seltzer, so it's fine. Okay, so we definitely looked through logistics real hard. But apparently, I fell for the thing that everyone falls through as a video game player. That until I realized I need to look up, I didn't look up. So that's nice. That's a quick good job you came in here and looked up. That's really good. Uh, let's erase that. We have a lot of high level stuff now, don't we? And then that. Yeah, we're going from 35 to 56 energy recovery speed. That's insane. I don't think we found a better launcher yet. In fact, I don't think we're going to double up on anything in particular, so we're just going to delete. Some fours. And our health boost is 44. Okay, we're good, we're good. Actually, we should clear out some of these. Reload speed. Who gives, who gives a shit about reload speed? Not I. Not I. Or recoil. Like, don't, definitely don't care. Blast radius up could be good, but it also seems really dangerous for charge. I feel like I'm much more likely to kill myself than be better at killing others. Ah, there it is. Tennyson Report. So sad, so strange, the days that are no more. For years, the Federal Bureau of Control has been wrongfully forcing a philosophy upon itself and its people. This philosophy is known to you all as science. We all realize that the concepts we explore here are mystic ones, with arcane thinking required to understand them. Yet we insist on using words like paranatural and parautilitarian to create the illusion of a scientific structure, to a tiny little system. The Bureau is desperate to stand with a closed-minded cult of logic and data that has overrun our society. If a thing cannot be quantified, then we dismiss it outright. We live in an age that is openly hostile of faith in the veiled forces governing our reality. I must remain anonymous for fear of reprisal from the anti-esoteric bureaucrats watching us from their plush offices. 
Those same bureaucrats, Trench and Darling chief among them, have been steering us away from the Bureau's arcane foundations for decades now. It is time we corrected course. If you stand with me, share this message. We are not alone. Yep, science bad. Science bad. Don't, don't do science, kids. You won't grow up big and strong if you do science. 